Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Dead Space 2. I'm KHead161 and this is Dead Space 2. Alright, last time we left off, um, we saw some people die and we saw a Hellblade break loose. This episode, we're going straight into hell. Uh, almost literally. <clears throat> but first off, you're the damn doctor put us on that stupid medication and, and stuff for it. Smash your legs! Oh god. That was disgusting. Smash them some more. No legs! No arm! No head! <laughs> well, you gotta have one thing, dude. You're not gonna be a me necromorph, I can tell you that. Okay. Oh, hello. Clark. Hi, the Clark, is that you? Hello? My name is Dana. I'm the one trying to rescue you. Why? What's going on? You're suffering from a unique form of dementia, Isaac. Something you can trust is on the image of seven. Uh, from the marker? Fuck. How do you know all this about me? Your dementia will kill you. But if you can get here, I can treat you and get you to safety. Why should I trust you? Because I'm not the one shooting at you. Fuck. Just follow the route I'm sending you. Uh, she makes a good point. Trust the people who are trying to kill me, or trust someone who says they're trying to help me and not shooting at me? Uh, I'm more likely to go with the other one, with the second one, unfortunately. Great. Oh, uh, looks like he... Alright, so the bloody footprints that go into that. These footprints go into that. Oh, wait. Into the elevator. What? No, wait, no, they don't. Oh, my God, that's a heel print. So... Any more? Okay, seriously, where does the blood go? They just stop. Okay, I get what they're trying to do there, but they need to put some footprints in here, because that doesn't make any sense, because the blood just stops. All of a sudden, it just appears outside there. And there's more of the footprints. So I'm guessing that's what the doc was doing. So he went in there, went upstairs, and that's where we met him. Okay. Lovely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This feature's back, which is awesome. Love that. I love that feature. Hey! What was that? I saw something flash up there. Whatever. And... Oh. I guess we can see whose blood that was. Oh, great. You could have at least knocked the heads off so they don't come back to Zachomorph. Like, I just... <laughs> How the hell strong is Isaac? I mean, seriously, it takes so much force to snap some, takes to remove someone's head from their uh, body. There's the neck, there's all the that ligaments and the and the neck and the why am I the spine attached attaching it to the head. It's not made to come off that easily. <laughs> I mean, neck balls like kind of makes sense because they're like decomposed bodies, so they don't. <laughs> Fuck you. <sighs> How does he just... I don't even know. They can't even be dead that long. They don't... There's not even any flies. That's why there might... But I don't know, there might not be flies in, uh... Space. I don't know. Okay. Now what? Oops, space station. And the top one is, a, is my first run through the game. And it's, uh, I didn't realize it was that long. Wow, this game is really long. On the other hand, I'm not gonna spoil, I'm not gonna spoil this, but there's something very stupid about this game. It's, you'll see what happens. You'll see what I mean later on. Hmm? Something? Hmm. Anything? Nope, just a very creepy, like, storage area. Ooh, I'm off, bucket. Man, I, this place could use cleaning up. Not cool. Not cool. <clears throat> and oh, what the? Huh? What the hell? Good question. they allow me access if I'm supposed to be like a patient they're trying to kill? That makes no sense. They oh! Going back now, 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 but going back now, going back now, going back now. Just kidding. <laughs> Wouldn't be much more last play if I didn't go if I didn't go forward. Uh, 
up. But yeah, seriously, why didn't why don't they just take away my my access ability? Because there's there's lots of times where you have to do this stuff, and if you're trying to kill me, why would you keep it so I can keep accessing these like grates and shit? Oh, god damn it! Ooh, floating. Isaac, what happened? Are you? Thermal blood. Why are you helping me? If Tideman finds you, more people will die, including me. Not if you follow my route. I don't like this. You don't have to like it. Just hurry before you get locked in. That's a lot of blood. Wow. Telekinetic surgical binding act, act, active. Deactivate. Let's get ourselves a new toy. And now we get Sneeze. Now, if you remember my my Let's Play of Dead Space One, which you probably, which you probably don't, that happened a while ago. This the Sneeze gun was pretty much useful in that game. This game, not so much. This thing is actually pretty useful. You can uh. You, it's still, you can still throw explosive stuff and throw body stuff, but now, when you pick up something pointed, you can actually use it as a weapon. Like right there, I can just shoot that out. I hear, a, I hear a necromorph. Yeah, that's what those, that's what these things are called here. By the way, this is right here. They're called necromorph. Oh crap! Oh crap! Oh crap! Gotta run! Gotta run! Ah, oh, missed. Should have been trying to be fancy. But now you can pick up spiky things like that and use them like actual shots. Like it's, it'll be as powerful as an actual gunshot, which is impressive. Another thing you can do is take off, is, is break off shot points, and you can use those as weapons too. But here's something I don't like that they changed in this game. Um, in, in, in the last game, whenever you killed something, it would just automatically like let loose stuff that you could use to uh, that you could use to like upgrade your regular items or stuff like that. That happened not for me. This game, not the case. You either have to stomp on them, hit them, do something to cause them damage again, and then they'll let stuff go after they're dead. Kind of a neat idea, because stuff obviously wouldn't just, ooh, health back, fall out if you just uh, hit, if you just killed something. Annoying as hell, though, because they'll, oh, explain this, those speed times when you get swarmed by, like, d dozens of necromorphs, and when that happens, it is so annoying to try, have to try and remember who you've shot and who you've done stuff to, and crap. Crap, crap, crap. Oh crap. Here, have some bleak. Spiky. I like spiky. <laughs> and it's so annoying to have to try and figure out which ones you've stomped on and whichever you haven't. And here's another thing, if there's too many necromorphs on the screen at one time, or if you wait too long, they would their bodies would disappear. And if you've been stomped on them to get the goods, you can't get them. So, that's a tad annoying. Wait. Which is the one thing I don't like about this game. Uh, I'm not sure if anyone's wondering or not, but if I have to comparing this game to the previous one. <sighs> this is going to take an interesting explanation. This, I'll try and explain this as best I can, but I'm not sure if you get this. One, this game, I believe, is a better game, overall. One, however, was a better horror game. That's what I'll say. One had all the, like, was the fresh new idea, it had all these awesome gimmicks, it had, you could, this, these necromorphs, this, uh, all those powers and the space station type, the outer space survival thing. I loved it. Two, however, doesn't have a lot of new stuff, it doesn't try and, like, uh, scare you as, scare you as well as the last one, it, it would have cheap scares like the ones we've seen already, the sudden on stuff or something like that, but it won't have like the fear inducing stuff that we had before. Come help me, please. I'm coming, I'm coming. Well, one had that, but two, however, has fixed the gameplay mechanics and has better stuff overall. One of which, of course, is Kinesis. Um, there's a few other things I think that are improved, but over, overall, I think it's an overall better game, but one was just a better whole game. So, and you're stuck down the floor. Eh, whatever. Money? No, ammo. I don't even have a gun yet. What could that mean? Shut up. <coughs> Can anyone hear me? A sec. Blue screen. A sec. Let's interface with it. Search for tissue. Calm down. I'll cut you out of there. Is that a tissue laser? A plasma cutter? Ooh, plasma. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. What the fuck are you oh. doing? Help! I'm trying! Help! Brian, I'm trying! And 
probably too late. <laughs> Suckers will save you, Isaac. Gotta say. Now we have our old plan. Now we have our old friend, the plasma cutter. Oh, I've missed you, plasma cutter. Oh, shit. Wrong arm. Haha. Uh -huh. That's the sharp one. There you are. <laughs> oh, what? Why are you so alive? Die! Fucker. Go. That one. That one activate. Nope. Okay. Now, would you shut up? Wait, what? What just happened? I shot him. Whatever. Get up. Whoa! Did not mean to do that. I swear to God. <laughs> oh, wow. No. Stop. Pick up the damn sharp part. What is it? Um... Let me get the damn sharp part. Oh, it's stuck in there. It's stuck in there technically, but it's not. <laughs> Glitchy. Okay, whatever. Shoot this guy. Let's see if I can get all through it once. Miss. There we go. Okay. Let's move on. Actually, we should probably cut this pretty soon. It's starting a little bit later. Uh, next time I see a safe station. Oh, like Eric, this. It's Dana. You have to dismember the creatures to stop them. I know. I've had a lot of practice. Oh, yeah. I'll stay in one piece. Thanks. Great advice, bitch. Would you rather... Maybe well, maybe I should maybe I should stay into two pieces. It'd be easier to... It, splitting up is better. Splitting up is always a good idea. Could we do prove that? And there's that. Huh? Shit. And then we use cut off the limbs written in blood. Why do I have a... Whatever. And, there's, and if you guys, if you're a military dude, why the hell don't you have a gun that I can use? I mean, seriously, seriously, you, you're a military dude who's shooting these things, and you don't, and where's your fucking gun? Did you, like, leave it somewhere? Did the Necromorph take it? I've never seen a Necromorph shoot a gun. Seriously, where the hell is your gun? Whatever. Anyway, safe station. Uh, overload, overlay, oh, yeah, whatever. And honestly, folks, that's probably a good place to stop, actually. No, it's not terribly long, but still, it's still a good 12 minutes or so, and that's a, that's better than the, than the old 10 lim minute time, time limit, at least. So, uh, anyway, I will see you next time on Let's Play Dead Space 2. For right now, this is khead 161 Good. Bye.